All right, everyone. Today I'm going to do an open box and I'm actually going to install this Z Torque uh, cordless drill shelf slash organizer. Let me show you why I purchased this Z Torque cordless drill organizer and shelf, and uh, then you'll see what I'm doing. Okay. So this is the situation in my garage. I've got this brand new Husky tool chest that my wife got me for Christmas. Uh, my old Craftsman is over there. I've had that for, I don't know, 25 years. So I, this is a really cool little chest here. I have all of my DeWalt tools and the batteries positioned back here being charged with my awesome setup here. I oh, know, <clears throat> don't laugh, but this is, <laughs> this is how I set up the, uh, you know, I just, the, the, true electrician I am. I just ran cable across the wall here and bam, I have uh, outlets over here. Anyway, you can comment it in the comments if you want and laugh at me, but you know, hey, it, it took me five minutes to put this up. And I'm gonna put um, the Z-Torque, which here's a box here. I'm gonna put this, uh, which is a shelf and organizer up here on the wall. That way I can lift these uh, batteries up, hopefully above the shelf there, and still be able to reach them and put my um, tools in the organizer up here. Um, I'm hoping that uh, the drill holes here are 16 inches apart, let's hope, because I have perfect little dots here telling me where the studs are. Stud here stud here and they're 16 inches apart so i should be able i'm going to try and lag bolt it so um let's get started i'll do the open box first and then come out here and do the installing all right i was going to go inside and do some like fancy type of setup but uh, i decided you know when i do it out here in the garage where i'm going to actually install the thing so here's the box here comes the open box let's go Thank you for your business card on top. Pretty nice, I guess. Let's hope she works. I'm going to put this on. Here. There's the inside. It's insulated, has this uh, kind of foam. And this was taped up pretty tight. So let me pull this bad boy out of here. Here it's all in one piece. And it is. So this is what it looks like. This is where the drills go. And here's the shelf where I'm going to try and put some of these battery batteries and battery chargers. So I'm gonna Kind of get the size of it. There she is. And one more thing in the package is look at these little screws they give you. There's no way I think that these things are going to be able to take the weight that's going to be on here. So I went on, I went in my old trusty jar that probably most of them have, where you have a bunch of old screws and bolts, bolts, and I actually have some lag bolts in here. And I found a couple of old lag bolts that I have that I'm going to use to uh, tie this to the wall. Now I'll put this away, fill it up again another day. Hopefully everybody has one of these jars. Okay, I had to go get my tape measure. I'm going to measure these holes. I'm hoping they're 16 inches apart. Let's see. Let's 
They are not. These things are like a little less than 14 and a half inches apart. That's gonna, that may be a problem. So we'll find out here. The entire thing is 16 and a half inches wide. So let's see what I, all right, got my stud finder and a pencil. I'm gonna try and find if there's a good area here where I can lag bolt this bad boy on at 14 and 3 eighths inches. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay, I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time. I thought I would never be. All right, so I found a way to get these up here at 15 and a half inches. And what I'm gonna have to do, I've marked it a little bit here, is I have to drill a hole here and then drill another hole over here, which is 15 and a half inches. And then I'll be able to install this thing with my lag bolts. <laughs> Here it goes. I grew up in a place where they told you what to chase, told you how to run the race. Every move was on the page, but I didn't like their way. I had to fight and misbehave, I had to find a way to change, I had to leave to find my way. Caught up in a daydream, I be in my mind up there almost daily. It's how I pass time, no opinion safely. It's how I understand what I want in this place. See, because everybody wanna tell you bad. Bad boy is installed. Now what I'll do is start hanging my uh, cordless drills up here. And I'll put my battery chargers and batteries up here and have them plugged in here. And uh, this will work for me. All right, I was able to put my wireless drills here and my batteries and battery chargers up here. Cleaned off my workbench area. Be able to use that now. This is awesome. Uh, these things fit nicely. You know, it's not, probably not, the most stiff sturdy that I've ever seen, but they'll hold up there. Uh, even better if I take the batteries out. If you like this, it didn't go perfectly. You know, I had to make some alterations to the Z-Torque to make it fit. Um, but you know, if you like this channel, please click on the like button and subscribe. Appreciate you watching, thanks, bye. I need a second to take a breath to keep me guessing with what you said. You're in my head. We're under pressure, we're sinking deep like stormy weather. Can't seem to breathe.